It's supposed to be a moment What good is being the one When you the only one that knows it <laughs> As you can see My nigga Steezo on the sticks His link will be in the goddamn description You feel me? My, my ISO brother That refused his to take over this game with me you go ask him why by the way go on his most recent video and spam swante greater than okay and i'll follow your weak ass back on twitter okay i got, I got the best build bro i got the best most unpatchable build amen now look if we get 1800 likes on this video i'll drop my jump shot video from last video it's the best jumper in the goddamn game my nigga we didn't get 2000 first hour if we get 1800 likes first hour y'all y'all got a chance to redeem yourself 1800 likes first hour i'll drop the jump shot video right after this home okay first hour y'all make sure you do that you feel me we are about to go into detail as you watch my nigga Steez on the sticks, y'all might ask, Swante, why, why aren't you doing this? You want to know why? Because we have these little fuck niggas. Down in the comment section, I need you to put fuck every nigga named Cole, okay? This nigga just, you know he just put my build out there and not crediting a nigga. So, you know, I gotta, I gotta rush my video instead of finishing my player. You know, not, instead of finishing my player, yeah, yeah, and I'm um, getting my own clips. You know, Steezo, we know we've been talking about this for a while. Now, um, I'm gonna go into detail about all that later, but we are going to talk about the shot maker 6 7 right now. Why it's the best build, why it will stay the best build, and um, why it's unpatchable. Mike Wink, you can't patch him, dickhead. Okay, so look, shot makers. We're gonna, we're gonna, I'm gonna show you all his badges or everything. Shot makers, and I'm gonna show you the exact build and everything. Shot makers have Hall of Fame ankle breaker. You will be able to be 6'7 and still have elite dribble moves. The animation glitch still work. If it don't work, you could just use Kemba or another. Here are three reasons why these 6'7 shot makers are that guy. Okay, Hall of Fame difficult shots. Hall of Fame tireless scorer. Hall of Fame ankle breaker. Okay. If you are an ISO god, if you are a PG in general, this is the best build. He's unpatchable. Once this little fuck nigga nerfs ankle breaker, you still have the highest ability of ankle breaker. Once they patch zigzag, you still have the highest ability of zigzag. Once they do something to stamina, you still have Hall of Fame tireless score. Once he like says you got a certain amount of stamina, you miss it more. You, you, you see the points I'm telling you. This build will survive all patches. I'm not telling you go make this shit. If you already got a 6-5 or whatever or a play shooter, stick with your build. If you got money, go ahead, do what the fuck you want to do. I'm not saying I'm not trying to get you to make no build or nothing. But this is going to be the wave. I promise you. Okay? Play shooters are okay and all, they're good and all that, but you can shoot even better with a shot maker to keep it a hundred with you. Here's why. Difficult shots, Hall of Fame, tireless scorer, Hall of Fame. When you dribbling and all that, you know, your stamina, blah, 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 blah. Your midi is OP. You can fade at any position that you're in. You're just dribbling, say you're just dribbling or, you know, you just, you act like you're driving and then you just back up and bang. You gotta, you got all the badges. Then you got mid-range dead eye on gold. You are a god, my nigga. It is so easy. And then you got like pick and roll maestro on like silver or some shit. It is so easy to get hot with this build if you're good, okay? Once you're hot, you get like a 10 plus boost on your three. You're basically a play shooter at that point. You, do you hear me now? Like you're one and once you get hot, Hall of Fame ankle breaker. Eat them up, nigga. Eat them up. And if y'all know ISOers, you know, you can finish at the rim unlike a play shooter. With a play shooter, you got to play like a bitch, my nigga. Like, you have to stop and wait so he don't block you. 
with these shop makers, you can drive and dunk that bitch. And you have the higher rating so you don't miss it. You can yam. You have speed when you yam. You feel me? You blow past a nigga and you yam. The reason 6'7 is better than 6'5 is because you're bigger. Since you're bigger, you're faster. Your speed is like one point difference. You shoot the same. If your strides are longer, a lot of y'all think of these smaller builds. No. Your strides are longer. You're bigger. You take up more space. When you do a momentum behind the back drive, you're big as shit. You get body animate. You, you're like a god, my nigga. I'm telling you. This is the best build, okay? Guys, now look. I'm going to tell you this. This measure to a play shooter, which is the other best point guard build, this is better overall. It's better in every aspect, L literally. Y'all might say, oh, he got like a higher limitless or something like that. If you know how to shoot threes, your ability to hit the three is damn near the same. You will get hotter faster with this build which means you will surpass that nigga then you have hall of fame ankle breaker hall of fame tireless and hall of fame difficult shots any patches happen my nigga you will be able to last and be more dominant unlike the play shooter bro you know they they tweak some shit on that shit you gonna feel it with a with this nigga when it comes to zigzag whatever you iso you gonna still be that guy, my nigga. There, there's gonna be nothing they can do to shop makers, okay? You already gonna have a big ass build. There's two new dominant builds. <coughs> Whoa, shit. There's a 610.4 that people use in a pro-am. I think White Chalk came up with the build, figured out it's still fucking OP. So you're gonna be able to be big and be more dominant and be way, way better to shoot than then them pure point forwards and be able to iso and there's a six seven play shooter i don't think no one gonna make that did you guys know a six seven play shooter could shoot so that probably means a six eight or no no a six nine shot maker could shoot i mean not shoot speed boost i'm stupid god damn it on the chart it says six eight shot makers can shoot but you can only go to six seven and point guard so if you make a um six eight shooting guard some of your badges is going to be nerfed so that's why i made him six seven okay now i'm going to show you his goddamn builds look man you see anyone anyone with this six seven shot maker build they got it for me okay bro i've been for the longest tweeting about it asking what when it can speed boost by the way they can speed boost at 88 88 i forgot to tell you this. you can speed boost at the second bar 88 i believe and that's easy just do the little g size method you can get 88 quick as shit bro you feel me you can you can get 88 quick as shit i've been building it on stream i've even set it on video i've set it on stream so many times I've tweeted about it. I've told mad people. And you know, when niggas just go and make builds, just like they did when I made that, when I was about to do the pure athletic shit, like, come on, my nigga. Can I, can I get some credit? I mean, you like like all of my tweets. You see all my shit. There's no way you skipped over me talking about this 6 7 shot maker I was making, my nigga. I mean, I just want my credit, bro. What do you have against me, bro? I don't, I don't understand. But hey. This is my shop maker. As you can see, I'm lazy as shit. You know, I, I tried to um have someone or some nigga named Badge Plug do my shit. Completely unreliable, bro. Uh, <laughs> did nothing. This is ridiculous. But as you can see, my nigga, look at this. Layups. This layup way higher than a play shooter. Look, driving layups. Look, look at the dunks. Look. You're a big boy. You can finish as a big boy. And look, that bar goes up anymore. Layups go up even more. Mid-range. Look. Then all your badges, you basically got a 99 to keep it 100, my nigga. Three-point. Your three-point is basically the same as a play shooter's, my nigga. It's just they have better shooting badges for the three. Ball handling, you know? 
we don't, we don't care about that. We don't care. But look, you're bigger, bro. You're gonna be able to rebound and like say you kick it out, you're gonna be able to rebound more. Your rebounding is gonna be higher. Vertical's gonna be higher. Your speed, that that's where it's, you know, eh. But the thing is, your strides are longer. So if you know how to actually move, you're <laughs> you're you're low-key faster than these niggas. You got, you got the acceleration, you got, you got the stamina. You feel me? That's the build. Now when you make this player, make the shoulder look i'm gonna tell you guys for ball handlers make the shoulder with the smallest always max out your wingspan and um what's the other shit and um you know just make whatever hand you want i think my nigga i don't know but look ankle breaker silver Th these are my badges right now man i gotta get on my grind bro um if y'all wanna uh grind my nigga for me and you want a shout out or some shit or a friend invite or a mod, you know, if you do a lot, <clears throat> hit a nigga up on Twitter, DM me for free. I ain't paying nobody. You got me fucked up, nigga. <laughs> but yeah, man. And um, that's the goddamn video. Let me see how much I made him weigh. Hold up. I don't even remember. I made him weigh 203, my nigga. And that is my guy, bro. If y'all enjoyed the video, be sure to like, sub if you know, and I'm out this bitch.